Welcome to the forest of despair. Don't even think... <coughs> Don't even think of trying to escape viewers from Let's Play Breath of Fire! I'm Michi Bailey. Let's check out this forest here. So, yeah, you got the saw from the village there. Head to the northwest to that forest we passed by last time. And then you can get inside. So, let's take a look around. Yeah, yeah, I know. How were you able to get into the forest if you couldn't just go through the side or something like that? I don't know, but whatever. So anyway, we got a new enemy here, the Ghost Knight. Or at least that's what I'm assuming the G stands for. Maybe he's just a knight with G money. I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, I got a little bit of a... Got a bunch of undead enemies, a lot of new enemies here. So, apparently a lot of people died around here. Just left their skeletons lying around everything. We got, uh, mushrooms here. Or, uh, stool. Oh, that's disgusting. No, no, not that kind of stool, viewers. But I do want to grab some treasure around here before, uh, well, heading to our ultimate destination here. Got another new enemy here, uh, if I can see their name. Yeah, Skeleton Rider. Yeah, these guys are a little tough. So, we might be able to kill them. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. Yeah, they got quite a bit of, uh, HP there. Fortunately, one thing I do like to do, like I was saying, I like to keep Ryu in the front row, so that way he's taking the brunt of the damage, since he has more defense than Mina, and then she can just focus all of her healing on him. Remember, the Cura spell heals exactly 50 HP. I took a life, and it's almost as bad as you got cancer. Yeah, a lot of the enemies here are going to be pretty fast. So, uh, you want to be careful here. And uh, try to keep Nina's HP up. I mean, Ryu, you can let him get down to critical, and you'll be fine. But with a lot of the other enemies around here, well, let's... Or, or with Nina, that is, uh, you want to be a little more careful with her. Oh, I, uh, forgot. I, uh, we got that new item, or new equipment from that chest there. Or, no? Oh, that's the next chest. I'm sorry. Lost my, uh, spot here. Uh, carry on. There it is. Unfortunately, we don't have Nina's zombie spell yet. She gets a spell, uh, Zom 1. It's like the harm spell from the, uh, from, well, only one game, Final Fantasy 1. It only damages undead enemies. And here we get the wrist. So, let's get that to Ryu there. A little better defense, a little more weight there for him. And the gauntlet, let's just hand that down to Nina there. It's well, just flat out better for her. So, all right. Let's, uh, backtrack a little bit there. Let's head on to the west side of the forest. I don't know if you could see, but there was a little building up above that chest there. Uh, that's where we ultimately want to go, but we can't just go straight up. we got got to kind of work our way around here. This place is a little bit of a maze. But, uh, nothing we can't handle. So, especially with the Earth Key on our side. And I have no problem abusing it. Because, uh, yeah, back in the day, the encounter rates were a lot higher to uh, pad out the games. So I have no problem blasting my way through it. Fortunately, Breath of Fire doesn't really require much level grinding, if at all. I mean, it does a little, like that one level at the beginning there. But uh, other than that, yeah, you're in uh, pretty good shape there. Well, is that like a... Hmm, you just kind of exploded there. But, all right, we learned a new Cure spell, Cure 2. I think that restores 100 HP, if I'm not mistaken. I, uh, I could be wrong on that, I forget. I mostly just stick to the first Cure spell. But I suppose you could go either way. And how are these zombies supposed to kill me? I think they just, like, when they attack you, they just kind of crawl on the ground and uh, 
Bite your legs off! Uh, what are you gonna do? Bleed on me? I don't know. Anyway, we got a teardrop. Awesome. Oh yeah, those zombies can inflict the, uh... I think they can in inflict the zombie status, if I recall correctly. If you let them stick around long enough. Uh, the zombie status... What was that th I think that reduces your defense to zero, doesn't it? Again, it's one of those things that I just... I don't encounter very often. So, I forget exactly. But yeah, if you get inflicted with the zombie status, uh, you're in pretty big trouble. But, you could just finish the battle real fast, like I do, and, and you don't have to worry about that. How are we doing on uh, HP? We're doing alright. Yeah, we're in pretty good shape. None shall pass. For boss time! Now, they're not really bosses, but uh, we'll take them out all the same. So, yeah, just use your uh, boomerang and the earth key. A couple rounds of that. That ought to take these guys out easily enough. Uh, oh, phew! For a second there, I thought I had Nina attack there. I was like, wait, what? No. No, we're okay. We're going to be fighting a whole bunch of these guys throughout this area. So, uh, if I decide to edit it out, that's why it's the exact same thing. Okay, well, let's just head straight up the middle. Or not. Yeah, yeah, we got hidden pitfalls around here, so you want to watch out for that. And here we get the long sword. Length does matter. No, no, but actually it is a pretty good single targeting weapon. Uh, like I said, you could, I think that was the one you could have bought back at Nanai, right? I forget. But uh, yeah, you could have uh, gotten that earlier, but I figured, well, why bother? You're going to find it now anyway. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to fall for that again. Uh, so yeah, uh, the, the long sword. now that we have it, you want to hold on to for, what, single boss fights? Or bosses where you're only fighting one at a time? Because the long sword actually is a little stronger than the, uh, than the boomerang. At least against single targeting bosses. So, you really don't need to hold on to weapons for Ryu that much, but early in the game you do. I'll explain why when we get to that point. But, uh, first things first, uh, yeah, let's use the herb on, uh, Nina there. Or I could've used a Cura spell, whatever. But yeah, I was saying don't fall for it, uh, never take the shortcut to get to the chests, viewers. There's a hidden pitfall there, so you wanna watch out for that. Okay, took care of those guys. See, I don't think there's anything in the lower left there. But, uh, I do wanna grab some treasure, as long as we're here. Ooh, acorns! Not quite as good as bacon, but you take what you can get. But uh, yeah, what the acorn does is it restores 20 AP. Not that I really need that right now, but well, it's just something to keep in mind. Eventually, we, it will be useful, though. So you want to hold on to those acorns for later, viewers. Okay, surely this is not a trap. Can't take shortcuts in this game, viewers. Oh well. Hey, let's see what we got. What we got around here? Uh oh. Nuts. Does that kill me? I have less than 50 HP. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't kill me. It just drops you to one. Okay. Phew. But anyway, there you get the wolf helmet, and you do not, do not want to equip it because it is cursed. And uh. If you equip it on someone who can equip it, they will take a lot more damage. So, e even though it looks like it raises your defense, so don't trust it. It's a cursed item. So, yeah, it'll make the big boss coming up uh, a lot harder. <laughs> you know the one I'm talking about, viewers. So, yeah, we can't go up the middle. So we'll just have to take the long way around. Oh, well. use the experience, but anyway, we got more of these, uh, did I show them earlier? Well, in any case, yeah, we got Lizards, I guess, I don't know why they decided to abbreviate it, but, well, whatever. Easy enough to deal with. But anyway, another herb, awesome. Let's see, before going up there, let's grab this treasure. 
right. Eh, these guys should be uh, easy enough now. Now that we've gained a level or two, should be able to finish them off without uh, having to do another attack, I think. Yeah! Got him! Go Ryu! And go Nina! Alright! Uh-oh. What the? They've got the chief back there. What's going on? Well, first things first, let's equip Ryu with the longsword there. And let's see. Let's uh, heal up here. Okay, these first three guys are the same as the ones before, so I'm just going to uh, uh, fight them off screen and be right back. Nuts. Alright, took care of those guys, so... Alright! I guess this guy's the real chief, so... I guess the other one was a fake! Oh! Well, uh, I already cleared out this place, so, uh... No, I don't think we need to do that, so, uh... Oh! Well, wait a minute, you got that weapon shot! What are you talking about? No! But thou must! Well... I can get them myself. You don't need me to lead. You don't need to lead me to them. That that's okay. We'll be fine. Huh? What the? Oh no! It's not a but thou must situation. Yeah, they try to trick you like that. Who's that guy? Let's get ready to humble for boss time. But. What happens if you say yes to him? Well, let's find out. Uh, who is this guy, anyway? General, okay. Yeah, let's see what happens if you say yes to him instead. Okay, so, uh, yeah, let's, uh, sure, why not? Let's go, uh, take their weapons. Just, uh, lead me right to them. So, if this guy's the fake chief, then why is he helping us? Ah, there's a secret passage here. What the? Nuts. Uh-oh. Crap. It looks like it's boss time in pog form. Yeah, if you, uh... If you say no to the chief enough times, you actually can skip this boss fight. But... I figure, let's show you the boss fight anyway. So let's, uh, buff up Ryu there. Remember, the protein B is, or protein bar, is the same thing as the attack up spell. So yeah, just basically uh, buff up his defense, buff up his attack power, and then Ryu should be in really good shape. Uh, I don't think it's necessary to use those uh, elemental stones here. Um, yeah, you know what, let's just keep on going with that. I don't think we need to heal up quite yet. Yeah, I'll wait for healing until uh, we get to his second win. He does have a second win, unlike those lancers we were fighting earlier. Uh oh, that's yeah. We uh, we want to heal up here. So let's do that. Please don't hurt us too much. Okay, okay. Yeah, we'll be in uh, decent shape. you guys. Alright, got it. Yeah, not too much of a second win there. So, we get a little extra experience, so sure, let's fight this guy. Why not? So, what happens to the general guy? Oh, sorry. Went through that a little too quickly. What? Hey, hey, it's Bo! That guy we were hearing about back at the village there. Oh! Okay, so it's like a Chrono Trigger sort of thing, with, with, uh, well, a fake chief and a real chief. Or just a general guy. For boss time! Okay, so, first things first. Let's go... Hmm. Yeah, let's go with a good attack up there. Oh, right. Uh, I want to bring Bo into the back row there. Hey, that rhymes. So, yeah, let's, uh, attack up 
pumpkin. And... You know what? Let's start with the uh, Earth Key first. Bo is actually uh, a pretty interesting character because he actually gets some black magic now. He's basically a battle mage. He can fight pretty well on the... Well, not on the front lines, but with his physical attack. But he can also use some decent black magic. Uh, yeah, fire, ice, lightning stuff. So let's use Fry because that's pretty much our most powerful spell that we got right now. So yeah, buff up Ryu there. Ha! Got him. And I'm not even going to bother healing Ryu because one more Fry spell will take him out. Oh. I didn't think he'd actually uh, do that, but yeah. Uh, so? Yeah, thanks. Alright, got it. Woo! We learned the hold spell. Yeah, basically, just like uh, Final Fantasy IV, the hold spell paralyzes an enemy, so they really can't do a whole lot. That's... So yeah, hold is actually pretty good uh, later in the game, like, against really high HP monsters. So... Okay, well, let's uh, head on back to town. But before we do that, let's talk to Bo. Hey, all right. More party members with Bo. I heard his name was, I think, Gilliam originally. Not Bo for some reason, but I guess they had spe or space limitations or something. I don't know. But uh, anyway, all right. Well, let's see what we got here with Bo. Let's uh, equip him with the short bow, which is a little better, the visor, and the chainmail to boost his defense a bit. Remember, do not equip the wolf hat on him. Even though it looks like it's better, it's not. He will take a lot more damage if you equip that on him. It's cursed. So don't use that. And we're going to have to walk out of here. Oh, yeah, that is one other thing. Uh, let's rearrange the party a little bit. Let's uh, do that. Are you in the back row there? Yes, okay. Let's just keep Ryu as the only one in the front row for now. Let's see if we go here. Okay, we get a white antler, which restores AP, but you want to save that for later, because you'll need that in order to progress with the plot sooner or later. Now, to be fair, you will be able to find another one eventually anyway. So if you don't get this one, or you used it, don't worry about it. You can get another one later, actually right when you're required to do the quest. So it's not a big deal, but, well, do whatever you like. But what will we do now that we got the real chief back? Find out next time on Let's Play Breath of Fire. This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.